The next test is called the jerk test, and this is checking for instability of the glenohumeral joint in a posterior direction, also possibly checking for a labral tear, posterior labral tear, a reverse Bancart lesion in the shoulder. In this case, you'll stabilize the patient's scapula posterior. Take the arm elevated to approximately 90 degrees as you secure the elbow. Internally rotate the shoulder, and you're going to apply an axial load, a compression load. And then, while holding it in internal medial rotation and applying the axial load, you'll horizontally adduct the shoulder. And if it's a positive test, typically you'll get a clicking sensation, which will signify a torn labrum posteriorly, or you may find some laxity posterior and the patient will complain of some discomfort posterior and you'll feel the humeral head migrating posterior if there's laxity. And that's called the jerk test.